This trip was a working trip. That doesn't stop one from having some awesome sightings, making unforgettable memories in the process. The trip there from Joburg was a bit slow and light on sightings. Entering at Malalaan Gate and having to travel all the way up to Sotara, where we were going to be camping for the duration of the stay. A nice sighting of a Nyala bull, and a close encounter with an elephant feeding, along with a couple of scattered bird sightings, was how the day started. The rest of the drive to Sitara was uneventful, but after setting up camp, I was greeted with the most spectacular sunset and a lion calling not too far in the distance. Our early morning commute along the H7 was filled with birds, elephants, a lion or two, and some general game. The early morning light making it for a perfect photo and video opportunity. My region of Sandpox Honorary Rangers was tasked to build a vegetable garden at a ranger station near Open Gate. This was the main purpose for my trip, to assist with the build. If you would like to support the Sandpox Honorary Rangers, follow the link down below. A rewarding hard day's work in the sun, we stopped at Bobby Arn Kranz to watch the sun disappear before heading back to Sitara.
On our last day of the build, we took a slight detour on the S12 where we end up following a big male leopard marking his territory for a couple of kilometers. If only every morning's commute to work was well, like this. We eventually headed off and finished the build, ready for handover. As a reward we were able to have some sundowners sitting in the now dry Timbavati river watching some elephants feeding. My last full day in the park was spent just driving around the Satara area. Between the full moons in May is rutting season for impalas. Males in a constant state of conflict with other males to start the breeding season. Their calls and barking can be heard pretty much throughout the day and night. The day was however filled with sightings, but the last two sightings of the day would count as a highlight.
an African wildcat was getting the last of the sun in a far off distance, and although it was not a clear and great sighting, it still counts. On my way back, right outside the gates of Sitara was a white line causing chaos in the middle of the road. Great end to a great day. The following morning was the long trip back to Joburg. The rewards were, however, plentiful. After not seeing much on the road, the first sighting that I had for the morning was a leopard hunting warthog. All the anticipation and the thrill of the hunt in full view. Eventually the warthogs lost interest and moved off, leaving the leopard and all the onlookers slightly upset. A quick stop at the Nkumbi lookout point. It was on to Lower Sabi, then Crocodile Bridge, then hit the highway. However, there was still one surprise to be had. I'm not sure how I spotted it, but I'll take the W nonetheless. A leopard hunting steerbok. The leopard eventually moved into some long grass and disappeared altogether. Just before the gate was a large elephant eating off the side of the road. Thus brought the close to an awesome trip. Don't forget to like, subscribe and ring the bell for notifications.